I'm so tap tap and welcome back to Valhalla. It's kind of nice to record something that even Parker can't mess up, because there's no real mechanical difficulty of any kind. Bosh, well, she clean the chicken buckets she throws out. Everybody can smell the spice from a mile away. Yes, they can, Parker. I knew you'd be coming. Yes. Wait, have we... Have we played these ones before? I wonder why some of them are locked, like... Do we actually unlock them by, like, beating the game or something? Or... You could take a couple minutes more, you know? I'm fine, thanks. How did you get the helmet off? Turns out the release button was jammed with ashes. Ashes? Hello? Excuse me. Excuse me. I'm playing a video game here. Thank you. Whoever owns that helmet made sure to use it to the point of voiding the warranty. Keep it safe, Parky. 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 Come on. Keep it safe in case she comes back, okay? You just... I just... Get... Crinkles, look. Cats hate aluminum foil for some reason. Now, take it away from me before I feel compelled to put it on again. Right. Yes, it's open! Great! Welcome to Valhalla. Good evening! Um, what kind of place is this? Completely ill-fitting voice! You would better not be another sex bot. At least your opi sex bot instead of gross other sex bot. Do you often enter places without knowing what they are? Yes. Sorta, kinda, yeah? Well, this is a bar. A bar! Nice, nice, nice. Uh, what can I get you? I don't know. I don't drink much, to be honest. What do you recommend for me? What do you normally enjoy? I like tea! That's not something I can work with. <laughs> What about flavors? Bitter, but not too bitter? Sorry if it's too confusing. Something bitter, but not too much. Like bitter and girly? Let's see what I can get you. Uh, flavor, bitter, grizzly temple? Bland. Uh, none of these sound girly. Oh, this one, Sunshine Cloud. Boop, boop, Bronson next. Um, on the rocks, blended. There you go. Try this. Yep, this will just use fine. Thanks. You don't look like you're from around here. What part are you by, Miss? I'm the star that always shines in the dark night sky. I'm the glow that will guide you through your sorrow. I'm the Northern Light that will show you your dreams. I'm Kira Miki. You're, you're fake Hatsune Miku? So, should I call you Miss Miki or Miss Kira? No, you're not getting it. I'm just Kira Star Miki. Kira Miki. Here, let me help you. I'll say Kira and you say Miki, okay? Okay. Kira! Miki. No, no, no. Put more spirit into it. Kira! Mickey. Almost there! Kira! Mickey! Kira! Mickey, why do you do these things to me? Why do you do this to me? Kira! Mickey! Hey, you, Gillian. Kira! Mickey! That's it. Are you feeling it? Kira! Mickey! Why are we doing this? When will my torture end? Mickey, etc. Oh my god. And don't you ever forget it! Dot dot dot. What the hell am I doing out here? <laughs> um, where were we, Jamie? Right, I was telling you. Wow, you're good. Thank you! It's nice to know I still have it. Especially since I have a concert in a bit. Concert? Oh my god, she has a reaver bot on her ear! We're all gonna die. She's got a freaking reaver bot for right near. Wait, you're the Lilum that's putting on a concert tonight? 
I'm one Lilim who's putting on a concert tonight. I don't know if I'm the same Lilim you're looking for. What are you doing all the way down here? Well, they were making last preparations for the concert, so I snuck out. My producer is always obnoxious while that's going on, so I decided to leave. I saw one of the concert's posters outside and decided to check out this place. You should, you should probably not not do that. Just that? Isn't that a bit dangerous? Won't your producer be mad when you go back? He will, but it's not the first time I've done this. And he still needs me to do the concert anyway. Uh, I see. How big is the concert? We planned for a bit over 100,000 people and sold out fast. So we managed to cure ourselves another show in a couple of other weeks. Bleh. Words. Oh, that's nice. Yeah. I may not have as many fans as other performers, but mine are loyal, and that's nice. Over 100,000 is not that many. Hold on, then based on your little demonstration before, should I call you Miss Mickey, right? You don't get it! Let's start- Oh no. 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 I'll just call you Miss Idol then. Oh, I like that. Hey, do you have anything soft? Like a pillow? That was an alcohol free? No, I meant soft as a soft. Soft? Soft? Soft. A cloud is soft. Wait, wait soft is a thing. Whoa! You should know this. Okay. Let's get her something soft. Wait, didn't we just get her this? We just gave her this. We literally just gave her this. On the rocks. Blended. I like this thing where it's like... It, it's like, oh, what a mysterious thing. And it's like, oh, no, we, we literally just gave you this. Yeah, this'll do. Thanks. Hey, have you considered being more theatrical when mixing drinks? Eh. Yeah, you know, like spinning bottles and lighting drinks on fire. That kind of stuff. When I was in college, I tried going to party once. Oh wait, that's me. When I was in college, I tried going to party once. Bartender who tried those tricks gave me a nasty bump on the forehead when the bottle slipped his hand. This kind of theatrics usually feel pointless and seems to throw down the process of actually making a drink. Yeah, but never underestimate the power of putting on a good show. Whatever, Miss Reaverbot. You can feel incredible and very rewarding, you know? I'll keep that in mind. Hmm. <laughs> Hey, is this glass important? Please don't break my glasses. Depends on why you're asking. Do you want me to sign it? <laughs> How do you sign a glass? Like, laser etch it? No guessing! Are you sure or not? Yeah, geez. J do whatever, bro. Okay then, who should I make it out to? Maybe for my boss? I wonder if Gil would like it though. Your name, girl? Oh, for Jill then. For Jill, never lose your star from Kira Mickey. Oh, that's a pretty autograph. Thanks! No, thanks. You. I'm guessing from somebody as many friends as you has their fair share of stalkers, right? That's 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 a good pleasant topic to just wander into. Just hey, how many people stalk you? How many people lean way too close to you and sniff your hair at a bar? Anyway. Normal questions. Well, there are two kinds of people that obsess over me. They're the shy ones that follow me everywhere, hiding just out of sight. And then there's my fan club. What's the difference between them? The fan club follows me around a lot too, but they usually keep a distance. Actually, I think they're outside waiting for me right now. Oh, that's good. I see. They're also very organized. They make pretty good soldiers. That's pretty creepy. Very creepy. The others, the stalkers, are a bit sneakier and don't act in groups. They walk single file to hide their numbers. I'm guessing the stalkers must be bothersome, huh? <laughs> cool. <laughs> Actually, they're not that bad. Stalkers are nice when you get used to them. Yeah, I think she's got a couple high-res screws loose. I remember one once protected me from being mugged. By another stalker, probably. There's another that breaks into my house once a week to make me breakfast! <laughs> oh. I see. She fails to see the problem. <laughs> I just wish they'd leave my underwear drawer the same way they found it. I take pride in how neatly I organize my underwear, you know? Why would you... Why would you go for the clean underwear? I mean, what do you... What do you... What... What are you gonna do with that? I take pride in my old liquor collection. I guess it's the same. 
Well, wait. <laughs> no. Old liquor collection. Panties. Same thing. Yeah, you get me, Jill. Okay, one more drink before I go. By now, the stage should be all organized. So the fallout should, should have settled. It's a bit late for a concert. It's part of my gimmick. I always go make concerts go from night till dawn. In this one, I'm supposed to close with a song called Sunshine Stone. If everything goes as planned and the weather forecast is accurate, the sun should come up just as I reach the climax of the song. I'd be depressed if they asked for your love as a drug as an encore, though. That, sound, that sounds nice. Hey, I need to make people feel their tickets are worth a ridiculous price, you know? Don't you think it sucks to pay for something only to find out you shouldn't have bothered? Uh, yeah. One time I bought some expensive coffee in this one cafe. Tasted like filthy water with cream. I still don't know if the coffee or the girl had served it, but it was bad. Man, that sucks! Speaking of which, do you have anything bitter? I really need to wake myself up. Are you... Uh, I haven't given her any alcohol. She, want, she just wants the same thing. Asked for slightly differently. I, I want to give somebody the old fedora. The good old Reddit classic. Um... Frothy water. Um... I'm guessing she seriously just wants the third same drink. You know, for a performer, you're pretty boring, lady. Um, I guess it's just a hint to not put alcohol in it. I wouldn't want her too drunk for the show, though. There you go. Here's the exact same drink for the third time. Yeah, this works. Okay, maybe that wasn't the perfect, like, I don't know. So, how is it? It could be a bit sweeter, but it's delicious! Okay, there was something else. Figured it was for waking you up or something, so... Really nice! Thanks! I hope you aren't offended by this question, but... I can see you enjoy what you do, but how much was about the music? I'll let you know that before becoming Kira Mickey, I was a very accomplished pianist. I had concerts every week and part-timed in bars with a jazz band. I still write and compose my own songs! Whoa. Why the change? Going from jazz to piano to idol? Have you ever thought about the power music has over people? You could argue it's just noise, but it can make you feel a wider range of emotions. I'm not sure many people argue it's just noise. And that power is universal! It can transcend language and culture! Being in a jazz band or performing recitals, I can only take that power to so many people. But being an idol, I can take that power and spread it far and wide. Kids and adults, men and women, they'll have access to my music and I can reach every one of them. I'm pretty sure jazz can still do that. Wow. What music do you like, Jill? I'm not picky, but I prefer versions with no lyrics. Why? I like to listen to music while working. Lyrics distract me. Besides, it always bothers me when people nonchalantly start singing songs with creepy lyrics. I think only half the limit sisters actually care about what's being said. Oh, that's a bummer! I'd give you a copy of my latest CD, but I don't have any in the moment. Don't worry about it. Okay then, I'm out! Thanks for helping me pass the time, Jill! Sure. Please come again. I'll make sure of it! I like how we have like QR codes in the background here. She be all right? Yeah, she'll be fine. You think she'll come back? Usually I'd say no, but honestly, don't know. Boss, we're done. All right. You feel like going to that girl's concert? Nah, I don't think so. I don't have tickets anyway. Hey, boss, does the name Red Comet ring any bells? Why, well, that was my moniker during my wrestling days. Your what? That's what they called it during my time in the Grand Slam Fighters. They saw me coming. They wouldn't stop when I crashed into their heads! Any reason for being red specifically? That way it was three times faster! That's how that works. How did you find that out? Do you like wrestling? The client mentioned it yesterday when he saw you. I just kind of remembered it. 
Ah, I see. I should take you to a wrestling match sometime. Maybe you'll like it. Maybe. In any case, Guild's cleaning the glasses today, so I'll leave now. Wait, what? I, I figured I was in for another, like, hour-long session. Like, the first half of today was 45 minutes, the second one is like, 15 minutes? I figured we were gonna get, to get two customers per session. Don't cram anything on your head without thinking, please. Huh, <laughs> yeah. Zero mistakes? Grab on the snack on the way home, it's on me. Flawless service! Aw, oh, yes! Thanks, total mistakes. Jill is humming, your love is a drug. Find the song will prevent her from getting too distracted. You can now browse Kira Mickey's blog! Um... I gotta buy that love drug song. Three hundred dollars! This magazine is three hundred dollars. Idol, idol hell! A magazine with all things idols. Mm. All right, shoulder massager. A shoulder massager. Um. Replica toy Turing. I want the Turing, but it's so incredibly expensive. I still don't know what that is. I, I know Yik. That, that that. I think I've heard of that. I, I can't. I can't bring myself. Kira Mickey. <laughs> I can tear the one off the Winnie wall in the vicinity. But tell us, sure as I have. All right. No, we're just gonna buy whatever the game tells me to buy. She will surely focus at work. All right, let's browse Kira Mickey's blog. Welcome, Jill. What? All right, you're supposed to click and drag. So much energy, so much love. I can feel all the optimism in the air. Heart, 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 and a fifth heart. Even after all the struggles, you still came to me and got to experience the loudest, craziest crowd my whole career. I'm beyond speechless. That said, I'm excited to announce we'll have a second date in the city. It won't be easy to set up, but I'm so happy my agency approved it. This is by far my biggest show, and I can't wait to experience again. See you soon, my darlings. Two additional hearts. Love, Mickey. Dome Concert by Mickey. Hi everyone! Are you ready for the dome concert? I sure am! Ugh, I'm hurting my own ears with this voice. <laughs> I perform in a rather large number of concerts every year, but even then I can't help but be excited every time I have one around the corner. And it's all thanks to you. Thanks to your energy and love surrounding my life in every aspect. I'm going to perform all of your favorite songs, so please be excited. Oh my god, she's Nintendo. But just one little request to tell this. Don't wait for me outside of the stadium or my bodyguards will get angry at you. I wouldn't like to see you hurt, so please don't do it. And stop stealing my underwear. It's slightly annoying. What I do to relax by Mickey. Ugh. The voice is messing with me. How much how long is this? Oh my god, there's so many. It's been very hectic as of late, so I'd like to show you what I do to relax. Sitting on rooftops. I'm on the road most of the time, so I don't have a specific rooftop to relax on. I like to feel the breeze and see a beautiful vista. It makes me think about life, Tilda. Tea cocktails! Oh, this is something I can't live without. Mixing tea with vodka, rum, gym blind, you name it. Any tasty and natural combination. And I'll be all over it. That sounds awful. I'm very careful about getting tipsy before a show, though. I wouldn't like to ruin your evening, emoticon heart. All right, that's enough of that voice. Let's see what's going on on Meme Chan. Mickey Concert 3. I don't want fights. This is, this is the worst 4chan ever. Of course they want fights. What's wrong with being a guy in danger? You, what do you see? Why do you care if we assume you're a girl? Dude's in danger, you. Let's get back to the concert, please. He started anything by mentioning he is a guy. I guess it's supposed to be inverse 4chan in a way. Danger you meet up. 
Like I'd want to be with a bunch of ugly girls in front of my friends. More, no more shit posting. This thread is closed. No shit posting. Did that one on left? And this is how you know it's not real, 4chan. No shit posting here for you. Revelation, blah to do. Childhood friends. It's just like one of my Japanese animes. Okay, so this is what Mickey Lovers in Paradise, blah blah blah. So, so we're getting some OC action here. Alice Rabbit Thread 2. Stop forcing Alice. It's the face! SSL added and removed here. So we hate Alice now? Good. Just we haven't heard any news. December 17th will come, the second retribution birthday is coming. That font, spooky font, <laughs> it's happening. <laughs> spooky font. Time for despair, oh shit fuck. To face when I just got out of jail. Hi, cybercrime unit. I just wanted to let you know I'm not Alice, but in fact, your mom. Why are you guys so nervous? The only one getting f fucked is the admin. Fuck off, Alice, not this shit again. Oh wait, what, what day is this? Like, December 17th. What is today's date? Oh! That's in two days! Well, we're doomed. Oh crap, I forgot to read the cat's reactions. Why can the cat talk? I guess it's super intelligent cat. It's nanomachines. Nanomachines. This is just what happens in the war economy. I got ink parts? Did she mean the fan club or So that's what you meant by a tea like drink? That sounds disgusting. Um Spooky. Or a nice joke. How was your first kiss? <laughs> I tripped into a guy! <laughs> it hurt like hell. <laughs> oh, that qualifies as a kiss. I'd be lying if I said I wasn't curious how such a meetup would end up. I guess it's a pretty anime thing. I guess we did the anime accidental kiss thing, but it ended up like real world. I just realized my panties are hung on the thing here. I'm not sure that's how... Oh, uh, whatever. I guess I don't have like a drawer. I have the I have the orange box from Metal Gear Solid. I just noticed that. Can I interact? No. No, I can't. Oh well. At least we have a nice variety of panties and we've got all of five different shirts. Wait, what? What? Hold on. Kira Mickey confirmed as best pop star in history. Don't let anyone tell you otherwise. She's the best. Like, she had to be handcrafted to be this perfect holy mole. She's the top tier everything. And I'm baffled as to how there are still people hoping to be as awesome and hot and great they can't. It's impossible for a human being to top such an achievement. I, for one, welcome our new Rubico overlord and uh, could serve in your underground sugar caves. Well, he did grant this guy this guy's this wish, kinda. Interview Gloria Light and her quest for a Tino award. You look pissed. It's a local page. Is that me? What? That's not me. What? What do you mean it's a local page? Oh. I guess because of this? The Augmented Eye. In today's interview segment, no one asked for this. We sit with the Tino Award nominee Glorby Light. It's an honor to meet you. It's my pleasure. Tell us everything that was blocked. Uh, I don't I don't understand that one. Sorry, just because of the what we can do the money he'll use for that anyway. Powerful earthquake, million saved. Powerful 8.6 magnitude tremor has stuck the area of Neo San Francisco. Fortunately, modern science was able to identify the quake almost an hour in advance, providing the city plenty of time to prepare for the worst. How, how, I mean, aside from just not like standing on a railing outside, like on top of a 50 foot or 50 story building, how do you prepare for an earthquake? Um. But yeah, during a conference call, Glitchy's Prime Minister Quincy, his, his name is in all caps for some reason, congratulated the rescue teams at Neo SF for the rapid response in the wake of the warning. They're an example to follow, and we're certainly looking forward to implementing these advancements in earthquake prediction here in our beautiful city, which city is not currently known to be a seismic seismic zone. 
Seismic, yes. Okay then. Well, I guess reading the news pretty much made that regular video length, sort of. Why am I keeping these save files? Ah, whatever. Force a habit, I guess. Stay tuned next time for when we go go to work. That's that's fun. That's exciting. It's cool. Work. Very fun. <laughs>